Hello, my name is Sunday and welcome back to another video about the Inventory Master Asset. Today I'm going to create um, a character system with you. Um, yeah, let us start with it. Um, we go to Master System, create and open Equipment. So this is for the character system, equipment system, how you want to call it. Um, yeah, I'm going to reposition it on the... Uh, maybe on the right side. Actually, I guess you do not open the storage when you open your character system. Uh, be sure that the tooltip is again on the bottom side of the Hiroshi and click on the equipment system. So now you can position your yeah your character system pretty easily. Let me show you something which you maybe want to have. I don't know. I've saw this before and yeah. Um, I don't. I need more like. 3 one and this one and I don't want to have padding between them so much I want to have 5 and 5 and and in the width more one and the top one maybe you want to have like a characters in this top of this area so you can change this the, the design pretty easily with the padding so this is um, a way how you can handle this uh, I don't like this actually I will uh, I want to have a Another system I gonna create um yeah I gonna create this like this here. Um uh where is it equipment system and I just drag it up I just oops so I want this tool to underneath it and yeah perfect. And the correct system on the right side and yeah this is how I like and everything is right here. I want to yeah position or define the each slot so when when you change the slot size or the amount of the slots you see the equipment system script is getting more slots here you can define now here which slot um or which item type is for which slot so um maybe you want to have for the first slot here on the top left side it, it's now head the next one is the top on the right side. Um, maybe you want to have like a chest there. Um, yeah, this is how you can define um, the slots. This is pretty easily. I want to have head chest. I don't know. Uh, shoe, trousers, earrings. No, not earrings. A ring, hands, and two weapon slots. So I can show you how this works as well. Okay. And then I also want to change. Um yeah, I want to change this the the general design um like also this color um the inventory design of it um I also got a nice one here, this one looks pretty nice. I have to change the color, the size of it fourteen I have to position this more like this wait. There was it. Ah, there. Okay, this is maybe too small. The numbers are correct. Uh, this looks more, I guess, better. Yeah, this looks better. Okay, now what we also need to do is uh, do this away. Um, we have to do the padding now. Like 20 is, I guess, okay. Right, also 20. And top should be the same, like 55. Yeah, 55 is good. The bottom of one should be also 20. Yeah, this is nice. Okay, now when we got this, uh, we have to reposition also our text now. Otherwise, uh, it looks ugly. Yeah, this is okay now. And I also want to have this X icon on the top right side, actually. Um, right there, perfectly. Okay. Uh, yeah, what we have to do is now we want to have some items which we can gear so uh, I create everything uh, from everything one now so that it can show you how this works whoops uh, just a bow golden bow leather shoes iron shoes whoops uh, sword and do we get another one no okay perfectly um let me start this now Oh, which I forgot is yeah. Go to the player 
and attach this equipment system to the character system. So actually, I call this character system equipment system. I guess they are same. The both are. The, it's the same meaning. So you press C now for character system, and it's getting opened. And yeah, uh, when you right-click on the right iron chest now, you see it's getting placed on the top right side. Um, you also can just drag and drop it into it. But what you also can do is, um, yeah, when you try to drag and drop it on a, another um, slot, it doesn't work. You see, it's just jumped back to the old slot. Um, yeah, I drag and drop it into it, and it's also getting, uh, yeah. It's getting swapped or replaced uh, with another item. So um, yeah, we got two weapon slots. Uh, just let me just take another one, uh, other items on it. And yeah, I got another bow here onto me now. And when I uh, right click onto it, it's getting swapped. And the first thing which um, the system is doing um, is checking if they are uh, empty slot w uh, for the item type. And you see, it's empty item slot, so it's just getting placed there. And now, when now they uh, the system is checking uh, uh, both item or uh, both slots are full, so we have to replace one. It's getting replaced. Yeah, and this is how the character system is working. I hope you like it. Uh, the next step is to create a hotbar. And yeah, see you to it. Bye bye.